In this episode, you will see how audio amplifiers of the iconic Polish brand Unika are produced. Where are the days where you could have danced, you could have jived, having the time of your life? To songs played on a Unitra turntable. You cannot turn back the clock, but you can always return to timeless quality products. Unitra proves this by coming back to the market in a new modernized form and introducing devices stylistically alluding to the time-tested classics. What drove this passionate crew to resurrect the iconic Polish brand? What was important for us? It was to show the beauty of Polish engineering. This is also our main motto and a mantra reflected in all our considerations. We wanted to show off the skills that can be found in our country and produce goods that will last years. The durability of Unitra devices is ensured by their modular construction, which makes their repair easier. The high quality of workmanship translates to the highest quality of sound, admired by audiophiles and many more. We will show you what this mix of tradition and modernity looks like based on the example of the WSH-805 audio amplifier, inspired by the golden stereo era of the 70s, and how it's produced. Ready? Let's go. WSH-805 was redesigned in the R&D department with one of the largest teams of young audio industry engineers in Europe. The amplifier is inspired by Unitra's older model, WSH-205, now made with modern materials and components. Characterized by its timeless design with swing hour indicators and patented automatic switch technology, Let's start with the components of the device. First, we visited the Radmat company in Rado to check out how the knobs are produced. After a rod is cut on a lathe, the part is given its initial shape and holes are made. During the milling process, the distinctive grooves are created, contributing to the elegant look of the knobs. At the end comes the anodizing, an operation that gives the part its final shape and color while securing it from corrosion and UV rays. All the parts are sent for assembly at the Unitra facility in the Ursus district of Warsaw. Besides panels and knobs, these include the elements of the chassis, PCB boards, and parts made from plastic. All the key components originate from Polish and European suppliers. Before all else, a visual inspection is performed. Among other things, we inspect all of the front panels from Radmat you can see in the video. Precise manual work is vital in the assembly department. The worker collects the relevant component package from the warehouse and transports it to their workstation. One by one, each module is installed in accordance with the dedicated manual, which includes a detailed description of the task. The front module, which controls the whole device, is screwed to the device. A proprietary power block, powered by two separate EI transformers on both sides, is screwed to the base. What we can see here is a dual mono construction. Here we can see the stereo power amplifiers, a key component of the device which amplifies the signal. The back panel contains two boards, outputs for speakers and an input board, which deals with signal correction and pentiometer operation. Then the front panel is installed a switch cover, an LED indicator, and the swing-out indicators. During the assembly, the swing-out indicators are set to zero to ensure they indicate correct values. Now we can see how the knobs are loaded with in-house inserts, 
which allows them to be installed on the panel. Likewise, the patented bistable switches are installed as well. Their appearance is also a reference to the WSH-205 model. They are solenoid-based and allow us to change the states both remotely and manually. At the end, the chassis is installed. Its sides, cover, and the front panel, on which the previously prepared knobs are mounted. Finally, the chassis is clamped together and braced. Time for a quality inspection. The devices are now tested. First, their appearance is assessed, and they are checked for physical defects. Afterwards, the electrical and functional tests are performed. A report with a myriad of audio parameters is generated. And we're done. Unitra also produces other high-quality audio devices, such as CD players, turntables, or loudspeakers. They are made with the utmost precision and accuracy at every stage of production. And they are not meant just for the enthusiasts of the crazy 70s.